Hi, my name is Trey, and I'll be doing my NOC project on the protection of our forests. So first off, I'll be discussing uh, why forests matter. Uh, forests are a key part of the Earth's ecosystem. Uh, they support our health as humans, as well as the health of our entire planet as a whole. Uh, according to the World Wildlife Fund, besides providing shelter for people and indigenous species and indigenous tribes, they also provide food, water, jobs, and habitats that foster large amounts of biodiversity. Uh, also, according to the World Wildlife Fund, uh, forests serve a key role as a carbon sink, which means they absorb the greenhouse gases that cause global warming. And after oceans, forests are the world's largest uh, storehouses of carbon. So my main focus of the presentation will be deforestation and the harm it causes to our forests and our planet. Uh, deforestation is the clearing of large swaths of forests for the purpose of farming, livestock grazing, mining, drilling, and other economic activities. Uh, most deforestation today is caused by unsustainable agriculture, livestock grazing, and poor forest management. Oftentimes, uh, slash and burn tactics are used to open up land for new crop growth. And uh, according to National Geographic, in 2019 alone, about 17, 000, about 7,000, excuse me, square miles of the Amazon rainforest were ablaze. That's almost equivalent to the size of New Jersey. And uh, most of the deforestation today, um, it uses slash and burn tactics. And uh, what it's uh, being burned is being used for um, oftentimes livestock or for uh, to grow feed for uh, livestock. So here's some of the effects of deforestation on the environment. Deforestation has been detrimental to the health of the climate. Uh, effects range from loss of habitat, more extreme temperature ranges, and negative effects on water regulation, supply, and much more. As you can see, uh, Global forest cover net loss is uh, 5.6 million hectares per year. It's larger than the size of the country of Costa Rica. And most importantly, deforestation destroys a forest capacity to absorb carbon and increases emissions through the loss of a carbon sink and the gases released from the burning. According to National Geographic, 46% of trees have been felled since humans started cutting down trees. And between 1990 and 2016 alone, about 500,000 square miles have been lost to, de to deforestation. That's an area roughly double that of the state of Texas. So here's how you can help uh, heal the forest. Um, there's both large scale change and small scale change that you can do on a daily basis. So large scale change, we can implement uh, zero de deforestation policies uh, to, larger, to large companies. So they hold their suppliers accountable for their unsustainable uh, practices. Uh, we can promote uh, bamboo and uh, tree uh, plantations to produce uh, timber sustainably, and also to combat the loss of forests. Uh, we can restore abandoned farmland so that farmland doesn't go to waste. And we can support legislation and organizations like the Wilderness Act, the Lacey Act, both acts that protect our forests in the US alone, but um, more globally, we can support an organization like the Convention on International Trade and Endangered Species that protects forests and endangered species worldwide. And then some smaller things you can do are promote sustainable choices in your life and those around you. You can consume less meat and eat more of a plant-based diet, uh, purchase fewer single-use products and uh, products that have single-use packaging. Uh, promote the voices of indigenous people um, because these people are often most directly affected by habitat loss because they're losing their homes and they're often not very empowered and often ignored. So uh, whenever you have the chance to promote their uh, voice and promote their cause, you should, or you can even take an active role in promoting their cause and their livelihood. And then most of all, you can just educate your family and friends about deforestation and not only its effects on the environment, uh, but also I mean, the main causes of deforestation and just all the harm it does in general and what we can do to help combat it.
And here is uh, my works cited page. Thank you.